is Dan with a very fancy apron, and today we are going to make guacamole. Why? Because we accidentally bought three pounds of tortilla strips from Costco, and we have to eat them this evening. So, for me, I just like to make a simple guacamole. It's not the best, because I'm not the best. We just get some onions, we got a small tomato. I don't like too much tomatoes. I don't like tomatoes at all, but I suck it up. Now, I got some avocados. There, I think they're about to, ooh, they're perfectly ripe. So we gotta make the guacamole right now. And we got some salt and pepper and our googly eye bowl. This is optional, use any bowl. So I got a spoon to mash it up and knife to knife, I mean like cut. Okay, so it's time to cut open our avocados. So I usually just cut to the seed and go around until I meet the other edge of my cut and I just Shabang! Look at that perfect avocado. And then I just get the seed out and I throw it in the trash can. You can keep the seed if you're like that, but I don't want my seed because I don't eat the seed. So, just do the same thing for the other avocado. Delicious. Mm -mm. It's going to be good with some Disney Plus or Netflix. A perfect combination. Look at that. Okay, got the seed out. Throw it in the trash can. And there we go. So our avocados are ready. We'll leave those for now. Now we're gonna cut our tomato. So we'll just cut it into beady, beady little slices. Look at that. So many seeds, evil. I don't really like tomatoes, but it's okay. Ooh, look at that, delicious. Ah, my finger! I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, so just cut this. Don't mind the way I'm cutting it. I, I can't cut, I just cut how I want to. So I cut them into little bitty squares or cubes because we live in three dimensions. And I cut them into tiny squares because I don't like big pieces of tomato in my guacamole. Because like I said, I don't like tomato. My sisters like tomato though, but only Javi. So that's why I include the tomato in here. Hami never notices there's tomato, so. So we're just gonna cut these really small. I don't like the little stem part, so I throw that away. Nope, and that's it. So we're gonna cut off the other tiny tomatoes into even tinier tomatoes. Afterwards, we're gonna put these tomatoes into our bowl. But for now, once we do it, we're gonna put them to the side because we haven't even put our avocado in yet. You can put however much tomato you want. It is up to you. But for me, I don't have a choice because I have heavy. And if you have a heavy, you have the have to do everything. Get it? <laughs> okay. So we're just gonna move these bad boys on over here. See, that tiny tomato brought us a bunch of little bits. So now, we're gonna take our onion. Now, same as the tomato, I don't really like too much onion. So I'm just gonna start like shaving bits off, right? And for our, for our guacamole, for me, this would be enough. But for you, you may want more. So just start, just start cutting, go ham. Just tiny itty bitty bits and if you're like me you'll accidentally cut a bit of the tomato and push it over look i just did it again i'm sorry tomato okay so we'll just cut this up some more make it itty bitty for our guacamole delicious is what someone out of their mind would say to me i would not eat onions raw are you crazy okay so now we take our avocados and we sh take a spoon you take a nice spoon and you go to the bottom you turn and then spoon there's the entire avocado like that i'm just kidding i missed some so if you i usually don't like the super bottom it doesn't have the avocado flavor that i like it's like different but you might like it and i don't waste food because i'm asian so get all this all the avocado shabam today we're just using 
two avocados because it's only three kids are eating. Mm. Give some to yourself too, because you deserve it. Oh, I'm I didn't cut all of it on that one, but that's okay. Just, just keep scooping up. Keep scooping up. And there we go. You can already see, just from two avocados, this bowl is really filling up. Yum, 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 in my tummy, tummy, tummy. Mm. Okay. We're going to take these shells and throw them in the trash. Sorry, shells. Now, this is the fun part. So, step one, you eat it. It's a required step. Next, I just take my spoon and I just go, ah! If, if you like, you can get another spoon and you can be like those ice cream roll people who just go like and just go like that. But for me, I just like to go nice and slow. Nice and slow. Slow wins the race by Albert Einstein. That's a real quote. So once you've got it to a good enough pace, you it's not fully yet. You take your onions and your tomatoes. I almost said take your onions and avocados, but I saved myself. Start mixing some more. So this one you just toss it in and then you do it. We'll add in the salt and pepper later, but we just want this to be nice and ready. If you're really smart, you could just skip cutting the onions and tomato entirely and just stick an entire one in there and cut it with your spoons. But I don't have super sharp spoons, so I can't do that. So this is basically okay. This is good. I like a bit of chunk. So we're gonna season to taste. And I'm not gonna make the mistake I did with my steak, quote unquote steak, and put too much salt. So for now, I'm just gonna put one, two, three. Mix that up. For this part, you don't really need two spoons. It's just, it's just fun. So once you've mixed it enough, mix, 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 take a little taste. Hmm. Then you think, does this need more salt or pepper? And for me, I would say it needs more pepper. But for me, I wouldn't say it needs more salt. No, that's fine. So you just keep doing that until you season the taste. Make sure not to add too much every time because you can always add salt and pepper, but you can't remove. I learned that the hard way. You can always experiment with this, adding new things. For me, I did that once and it was a fail because I added fish eggs. Ew, that was disgusting. But I think it was also because I put soy sauce. So now this is basically mm, mm, done. Put those spoons away, put the knife away, and it's time to test. Is this yummy enough? Would you like to try, mother? No? Okay. Yum. Mmm. Perfect. I didn't get any avocado, I mean, onion or tomato in that, so I'll try to get some onion. Mmm. Mmm. The acidity from the onion tomatoes. It's perfect. So, if you're bored at home and you need a little chip snack, just make some guacamole. It's delicious. And if you don't like avocados, you're wrong. You like avocados. Mm, I'm gonna eat this now. <laughs>